Yeah, I just got in the car. I'm about to be on my way. Of course I got the Bluetooth on deck. I never leave home without it. All right, see you in a minute. And you shouldn't either. Go to Bluetooth.com and get your free month supply of Bluetooth. Type in my promo code JAW and get you it up. Peace. Oh. Why are you here? Tracy, right? We're not gonna do this. You know me, I know you. Why are you at my parents' house? Um, I'm dating your sister. Teresa's gay, try again. I just recently found out she was gay. But I don't think your parents know. That's besides the point. That's exactly the point. That's why I'm here. So what are you, fake dating my sister? To like... make your parents happy, yeah. So what is she like paying you or something? Nah, I wouldn't let her pay me. So what is this, like some weird sick fetish for studs? It's not even like that. No, it's exactly like that, Bruce. Tracy, I'm not trying to cause problems. You are the problem. What me and E had was good until she met you and got all confused and then moved off to Italy. Check this out. If you think you're gonna do to my sister what you did to E, I'm gonna cut your nuts off. And that is not a threat, it is a promise. Hey y'all, it's time to eat everybody. I think it's um, time to eat. The next time you come, you're gonna have to tie your camel up outside. I, uh, I know you was here. I see your car out front. I knew you, you, you had a heart underneath that hairy chest. I'm gonna go get the rest of my stuff. Don't worry, I'm gonna keep paying my half of the rent. me mr and mrs johnson the food was delicious thank y'all so much you're more than welcome and hey me and you gonna talk young man yes sir very very soon all right Bye, all right take care all right bruce wait so you just gonna leave you ain't say nothing to me all night i didn't have much to say to you i came here for your parents to get to know me better mission accomplished right Right. So we're not going to talk about the other day? Ain't nothing to talk about, Reese. You're a lesbian, and I played myself. In the story. It's that. It's what? It's complicated? You're not a lesbian? Because the other day when I walked into your bedroom, let's be honest, you was all over, old girl. And it's my fault. You showed me the telltale signs from the jump. The first day we met, you told me I wasn't the type and you wouldn't fuck with me. I should have believed you. And the biggest son of them all, on our first date, you showed up looking like Tupac at the Mike Tyson fight. But typical Bruce, blinded by the yams, played the fool again. What you mean again? Nothing. Nah, 
This is the second time you said something like that. What are you talking about? Let's just say I've been down this road before and I learned my lesson. I can't force a situation that's not meant to be. We are who God made us, right? Now, how you going to explain to your parents, well, I'm not going to be around no more? That's on you. Good luck with that. I gracefully bow out. Take care of yourself, Roseanne. Um, I'm finished business and unspoken agreements. Even after you wake up, you're supposed to be dreaming. I'm kicked back, but high enough for my nose to be bleeding. Steve Jobs, level plotting, just know he a genius. And watch the snakes, the sweaty poisonous. The pressure rise, they wonder how I stay so poisonous. <sighs> Selena, you got the worst timing. Go home. I didn't come over here for no bullshit. I just came for closure. What closure? Your boyfriend is crazy. I don't need that in my life. I know. Baby, I can be a bit much. But he's mine. Look, Reese, I really like you. But I love him. And if I'm going to make this work, then I can't keep doing this. So no more calls, no more texts, no more popping up at your house. I'm gonna go get my man. And I suggest you do the same. What are you talking about? Bryce. You mean Bruce? Bruce. He ain't even like that. I saw the way you looked at him. Yeah, because he ran up in my house. No, it was more than that. I don't know what you think you saw but I'm gay. You looking real ungay right now. You know I gotta dress like this for my mom. You about as gay as I am. Take care of yourself, Teresa. Selena, what's up? I need to talk to Davion. Uh, yeah, Davion, he not here right now. His car is outside. Oh, nah, it's a lot of neighbors that got the same car as him. That's all that is. So. We move. Okay. Breaking, Henry? Something battery? Yes. Dog, really? What you want me to do, body slam? What's the size for? Jelani, can you give us a second? Oh, yeah. Nah, you good, bro. This your house. You ain't got to go nowhere. What, Selena? When you coming home? I don't let her no more. I am home. Uh, no, you're not. I mean, home is 10 minutes up the street for you. Look, I know what I did was really messed up, but I'm sorry. Just for the record, since the last time I did what I did, I'm proud of the man I've become. But seeing you with old girl, it made me realize I'm not worth it. Oh, you are worth it. And I felt guilty the entire time. I was foolish for thinking that two wrongs would make a right. But now I realize that you are the man that I want to be with for the rest of my life. I cut it off with old girl. But not, not to interrupt, but uh, so you did say girl. So you cheated on him with a thief? Bro, you, you been crying because she cheated on you with a female, not a dude? Bruh, man, come on, man, get your big goofy ass up off my couch and go home. Hey, man, it's not that. It's the principle. Hey, you're right. But what do you want me to do, Davion? Beg, cry, like you did when I took you back the second time? Oh, 
I'm not coming home. Well, I'm not leaving here without you. So I guess I'm moving in too. Uh, not to interrupt and cut y'all off, but he not staying here. He's just here for the time being. So you can't stay here either. <laughs> unless, unless you call a girl you cheated on the way. She can come through and we can get it possible. Jelani, you're not helping, dude. Give us a second. I thought you said this was my house. Nickel. We'll see if it bears true. All right. Now the jab of Holyfield. The right hook by Holyfield. See, man? That's what's up, Swain. That's what's up. Baby. Baby. I know you're mad, but you're going to have to be mad at the house. I know you ain't ate, so come get this curry goat I got on the stove. Made plantains? Maybe you know I made plantain. I bet you ain't make no festival bread. Jelani. Yep, yep, I'm up. <clears throat> Let me help you pack your bags. All right, I'm going to just take one bag, though. That's it. Okay. Every time something goes wrong, I'll apologize if it's my fault. Most of the time you do the same, but every time we know that's not the case. Cause you be on some other shit. Sometimes I just can't handle it. Sometimes I gotta get away. Sometimes I really need my space. But that don't mean that I don't love you. That don't mean that I don't trust you. That don't mean that I don't care at all. Just because we disagree, baby, that'll never mean that I can live without you. Baby, I don't want to fight. I don't want to argue. Because it really don't matter who's right, who's wrong. Yeah, because either way, I'm going to love you. Don't give up because I won't give up. Don't give up because I won't give up. Who's right, who's wrong. Hey, it don't matter because I love you. Every time there's an argument, it doesn't make my feelings permanent. To the max.